Hi guys, John here. Well, it's a beautiful day here in Canada. Can't complain. Certainly better than last week. Been raining constantly. So I did promise Echo 230 SRM to review my weed eater gas trimmer. I'm gonna keep it locked. So I'm gonna have to open the key. I always keep it locked because I have some lawnmowers in here. wants me to review that green weed eater trimmer so I'm gonna have to go in a sea of machinery to go and get it all right so be with you in a minute okay so there she be so this is a straight shaft trimmer uh, direct drive so the s spool constantly spins so it's using your typical uh, green 0 0.080 inch diameter trim line uh, yeah, this kind of motor has uh, the engine code. If I just if I read it correctly, it's a 1998 meets uh, EPA emissions in California 24 cc engine. This engine also is used some older Craftsman models. So it's a Weed Eater XT600. So um, you can get them here in Canadian Tire. I would assume this cost 10 years ago around uh, $150. Yeah, the only thing is I won't be able to start it because the starter broke. So you can see if I pull the rope, nothing really happens. So Echo 230 SRM uh, told me to um, try to pull the starter and yank it like give it pulled jabs I can try that as you can see there's no effect so hopefully that would have caught the starter but I think the starter is cracked in there so that's why the starter rope doesn't catch on it so it sucks it used to run really good um, the problem is um, I don't even know if it's worth fixing because the guy quoted me a price on it that's um what was it charging me sixty dollars just to just to fix a starter but since the trimmer ran two years ago and I'm assuming it will need a carburetor cleaning so that's gonna be even more expensive so I don't know if it's worth for me fixing in today's um, mass production market you can just pick up a still for $150 for the same price to fix that weed eater or that Mighty Light trimmer that I used last week that was around $130 and they run perfect so it's using a uh, wobble carburetor I, was, I would assume you have your high speed and low speed adjustments you have your full choke, half choke and run primer bulb is here takes a 40 to 1 gas mixture and yeah I wish I could start for you guys just because of the starter for me I don't know if it's uh, worth repairing I can't repair this myself because I'm not a uh, trimmer expert and I find trimmers to be very complicated especially this model than your typical lawn boys but the only difficulty that I have doing is the, there's four screws here which is not a problem the only problem is that I'm worried about taking the engine apart from the drive shaft. That's the part that worries me. But other than that, it was a good trimmer. It lasted uh, pretty good for about 10 years, uh, was it 11 years right now? Yep, so here's your review. Hope you enjoy it. Peace.